In his State of the Union address, a maskless President Joe Biden said the U.S. is entering a new phase of the COVID-19 pandemic. Because of the progress we've made, because of your resilience and the tools that we have been provided by this Congress, tonight I can say we're moving forward safely back to a no, norm, more normal routines. Under the new guidelines, most Americans and most of the country can now go mask-free. Mask mandates are quickly being lifted in public places across the country, including in many schools, but some are wary of the rapidly changing public health measures. I don't know how I feel about not wearing a mask, um, but I understand the numbers are going down. You know, we're still trusting the science, but it's definitely nerve-wracking. A new tool has recently been added to the fight against COVID-19, an antiviral pill from Pfizer called Paxlovid. So at Pfizer, we're very excited to uh, have the launch of uh, Paxlovid, uh, which through our clinical trials has had uh, amazing results, over 89% efficacy in terms of uh, keeping patients from being uh, hospitalized or from, uh, or from death. The Biden administration is planning one-stop sites for testing and treatment with the new Pfizer pill. Pfizer is working overtime to get us a million pills this month and more than double that next month. And now we're launching the test to treat initiative. So people can get tested at a pharmacy and if they prove positive, receive the antiviral pills on the spot at no cost. The Biden administration is also preparing for new variants to emerge, increasing surveillance and genetic testing of COVID cases. They hope that even if a new variant does emerge, that schools and businesses will be able to safely remain open. Jim Spellman, CGTN, Bethesda, Maryland.